you can't fish anywhere but just here where we are legally and weather wise come around here and we've got a little sheltered pocket of about 50 yards that big coke boat again. Watch out for ways, Pez. You could surf that. <laughs> Alright, here's a fishing tip for you land-based guys. See these spiky bushes here? I'm not even going to attempt to go through that one. I'm going to go around until I get to a better spot because these things stab you through your pants and into your private parts it does not tickle so I tend to put my hand down around my private area run backwards and get my butt stabbed instead I was just walking through the bushes back to Pez didn't even notice, look I've got two shrimp I've caught on the blade I'll leave it on there. Got a big tailor. Yeah, it's impossible to fish anywhere but here. But uh, Perry's just caught himself a cracking tailor, which he's going to strip up. I mean, it's like a big tailor for down here. So we've caught whiting, dew broom, tailor. We just need a big winter trevor to complete the set. I'm just getting picked up on my big line little brim and stuff so I just picked up the gulp worm and started started uh, working these edges again these are whiting they're everywhere now I haven't been running the camera much we've just been bait fishing on the corner but I get bored with that that's my big rod there set up with a dew line but I've been baited and there's a whiting little gulp worms Oh, mate, that's a good tail of that. Yeah. I reckon you should slab it. this. <laughs> I knew. Oh, South Creek coconut. coconut. Yeah, everywhere I fish there's coconuts. And he's just screaming out, he's on again. Come and, come and, Massa. <laughs> Get another Jew. Jew number two, man. Jew number two, guys. I didn't even have a chance to bait my line up. Yeah. I just left you. Oh, that's the one. You're going to have to go that way, Pez. Which way? Oh, I'm pretty nimble. Do you want me to take Rod and run around and you run around and meet me? Oh, uh, yeah. you know what? He's coming. Just watch that pole if he turns. He's but he's coming. with current. And you never believe you get one Jew here, eh? Now you're on your second. Come on. What do you think of Aaron's little spot? What is it? That's not a dew. That sucks. I know. Yuck. And the head and the head shakes were all about a dew. Dew, yeah. You get yourself a Parramatta moray. No, nah, just a normal wheel. Oh, I call them moray. That's, I, that's a, me. That's my mistake. I don't know why I do that, but he's a big eel, man. <laughs> All right. Send it again. Probably. I mean, you've got wet my hands. I'll grab him around the bummer. Oh, there goes the other one. Yeah, just drop your other rod. Get that one. Oh, Take that. Yeah. yeah, I got it. Still on? Yeah. I'll settle down, buddy, so I can get ready. He's trying to do that thing that they do. 
current. <laughs> I need pliers for this guy, I can just flick the hook out. That's a nice brim, mate. Oh, yeah, it is too. Look at that. He's a nice brim. Look at the sidewoods, yeah. Not huge, huge, but. No, but nice. Nice winter brim. Well, Pace, you're going to have to. Uh... Slow down. Yeah, I'm <laughs> sort of stuck here holding your fish. I want to get my own. No, I was using the one before. I kept getting my tail bit off. Using a 1 0 hook. So I swapped to same little lightweight 116, but I swapped to a size 2, much smaller hook. And it seems to be making the fish suck it up more than bite it. Yeah, I'll give it a run. Into. Oh, there you go. We got our floated anyway. It was just, I get a bite, I get a fish now. I was getting a little tail, they were just biting the tail off over and over, and the hook was just simply too big. Okay, we got a little floody. I'm not going to carry that up to show Pez, but we're knocking out our species. We even got a Parramatta eel today, so we is on a roll. There he is. You go first. Let's see, you, buddy. Yeah, just drop down a size smaller hook. That's doing the damage. Got ya. Just shaking that. Seems to be the shake, seems to be the go. Another whiting. So I'll come here for the whiting today, Perry's come here for the juice. So we're both pretty happy. I mean, Catching fish like that all day. I really sort of nutted out once I put that smaller hook on. Once I put that smaller hook on, I started to suck him. See how he's got hold of that now? Like, he ain't letting go. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Open your mouth, I don't want to change it again. Look, he's just holding it. Okay then. But yeah, all I was doing was just shaking them in. There's quite a few out there now. But it just, I've tried everything, like, I tried just this sweet like that. It hasn't been doing much. Then I've been doing a couple of little hops like that, getting a bite. But it seems to be, what it is, is this. Just shaking it, giving it a few twitches. Over here, and I can hear Perry screaming, he's got another Jew. Ah. Oh, whack. I want to see his Jew. Take it. Ah, oh, missed him. Rushed it because I'm trying to. I want to run down and see his Jew. I got this really cracking whiting bite. Another one. Got him. Oh, that'll do. Doesn't have a big whiting. I'll go and check out Perry's juice fish. Yeah. It'll be all over, so I'm going to stay here. Uh, the whiting bite's really hot at the moment. Like, I mean, every cast I'm sort of finding. See this big jewfish, but are you still calling? Yeah, oh, I gotta go down and see it. 
come back in. Uh -huh. Bite's hot. No, I'll come back, we'll go and have a look. We got a really hot bite going on. I mean, I'm targeting Whitey. He's screaming. You right, I'm coming. He's screaming his lungs out. He must have a big one. Oh. Come on, come on. <laughs> Number two, Jew. Holy here, give me the rod. Hold him up properly. Number two power of Jew. I heard you yelling out, but I was. You know why they're on? Whiting everywhere, man. For every cast, whiting. Look at that. I'm fucking stoked. I wish you were there. <laughs> All right, mate, I could hear you. I knew you had another one on. Give me, let me get a few more shots. Yeah. Come around here, show it on the water. Look at him, what a cracker, eh? <laughs> Number two. Pinned him straight oh, there. Yeah. Now, you liking my spot or not? Mate. Mate. What can I say? Look at the girth of him. Hey, what do you reckon that one's about eight kilo? Oh. Uh, Seven? Well, he's heavy. Yeah. Have a feel. He'd be up around that 15 pound, easy. Now you got your hand under his belly. Get your hand down near his. Grab that big bottom fin. Like pinch it. Pinch that with yeah, your two fingers. Hard. You can Sleep do it. Yeah, Put his head down. Smile. Oh, I can see. I got all the dots coming out on that. You want to see it? Turn his. Give me one mouth shot. Perry just got another Jew. Um, all that screaming and yelling off. I just dropped my rod. I've got to go and find it. But if I don't get my rod again, here we go. I've got another one, Aaron. Oh, awesome fun, man. Right, one of my rules, man. You never put your green rod on the ground. I can't remember. I think I was running with it. With Pez, I'll go back and check. Just one bump. There it goes, there it goes. What the hell? Oh. There it goes. That's a brim. Biting your head off. No, that's how I did it before. Did it? Bang! Mm. I'll have a couple of casts while I'm waiting. It's already rain for another half an hour. We're having too much fun. Who you got bites on this one now? What's, good, what's on this? Right, it's alright, just if it, if it bows. Mm. You can bite on that one, bites on this one. Oh, I've got bites on this one. Yeah, you're gonna get another Jew here, man, there's whiting in here. He's on. Take it. I just dropped mine. A bit unbaited, no to gulp on. Look at that, completely baited. I'm gonna set the hook on this. They're a little whiting. Are they? Yeah. Little yeah. But that's what's bringing the dew in. They're coming in to eat the whiting, that's why I've got more dew on this little gulp worm than I have on uh, but I can't believe big it, baits. Eh? Yeah. And I reckon it's going to get even hotter. Yep, it's just starting. It is just starting. cast in and I'm going to go back to my fuzzy but the the whiting are all the way along here now so the beautiful fish aren't they huh? the jewfish they're a beautiful fish yeah, 
Oh, this one. Oh, I don't miss that. Whiting. So I'm saying the Jews are every cast I've been getting whiting. The Jews are uh, coming in feeding on these guys. <laughs> How'd you put one of them on a hook? Oh, I'm, I'm outside here. Hey guys, the rain's coming in. That's sort of the end of our day. So we might clear up, we might keep going, but I'd just like to thank you for watching these videos. Please hit the subscribe button. And anything you're interested in on these videos, come into the shop. Come and have a yak with us. That's why I got Perry out here today, because he loves his Jew fishing. It's easy to take him out and get him onto these Jew so he can explain it to you guys. It's pretty simple fishing. There, yeah, I'm on another one. Looks like a little, little flathead this time. That's that sand spit we were on earlier. The tide's lifted up. Oh no, little brim. Tide's lifted up on top of it. Where all that shell grip was. I'm just gonna get one, one or two last fish. I think the only thing we haven't got today is the trevally. somewhere else now. Do it right. Oops. They're right up on the um, on the rocks now. Fish everywhere. We've got a half decent flathead this time. I'm just walking out. Day's over. <laughs> Have a look at that. The day's over. <laughs> and the bug is swallowing my hook hole too. Yep, cheeky bugger. Come here. Come here. Grip behind those gills there so you don't cut me. Take a bite of this fella. And uh, sorry, Mum, if you watch this. Happy Mother's Day, but the fish were just biting their heads off. I'll have to see you tomorrow. These little gold worms, the most underrated lure you can get. There's not one fish that I haven't caught with these including Big Jew. You never see any of the pure fishing boys showing it, like working these worms, but honestly, they are one of the best plastics on the planet. Rain time, drain time. Oh, there he is. Again. Ah, oh, got me. Dag nabbit. Last cast. Another Jew bait. Now you can see why there's a Jew season and basically the start of autumn. The Jew fish can't handle the hot water through the summer. So the start of autumn, they roll in here and they just go nuts on those little whiting. 
Okay, fitting time. Uh, this has been the most atrocious weather we've had all year. We've caught two dew, three, four flathead, a dozen whiting, probably six or eight. I've got three or four brim. Pez has got another half dozen, probably ten brim. Uh, what else? Some other weird fish we caught there today. But anyway, it just shows to show how good this fishing is. Uh, and there's Pez waiting for me. <laughs> you caught bait, mate. Still, I don't care. Oh, that's a better one. when you're ready to go. Love this place. Maybe one good reason why you can't catch and release in here. 